Louisiana Folk Roots is getting ready for another summer of teaching children about the Cajun and Creole culture, and of course that includes music. That's right. News 10's Gerald Gurnag joins us live from Vermilionville with more on their upcoming kids camp. Gerald, good morning. Hello, Acadiana, and good morning. We are live at Vermilionville telling you all about Louisiana Folk Roots. It's Kids Camp coming back this June. Uh, super important to Louisiana Folk Roots, uh, an, an event, I say event, uh, this camp foundationally is what Folk Roots is all about. And Folk Roots is something you and your family have been a part of for a very long time. Well, I actually started Louisiana Folk Roots. I started the nonprofit when I know. I, I didn't know. If you, I didn't know if you wanted to. If you wanted to go, I'm messing with you. I know Christine. That's what I'm saying. So very, very involved. Yes, very involved. I started the nonprofit um, when I was pregnant for my oldest daughter, who's 20 now, and um, it was to be able to do events where people could get a little break from their everyday life and just focus on learning something new for adults actually we did it for adults and we still do things for adults but it was obvious that we needed to do something for kids because that's how we keep it going and now kids camp has turned into Acadiana um, if you've ever thought about or if your kid has ever mentioned or if your children have ever mentioned wanting to learn how to play Cajun or Zydeco music maybe they're at a festival maybe y'all are at a restaurant maybe y'all are at a dance and and they're and they're you know just captured by what's going on on stage not only will they be able to learn that style, the foundation of how to play that music, you're hanging out with some top-notch musicians, probably some of the ones you've watched at festivals or events around town. That's been a huge draw for the kids as well. Definitely. They're all professional musicians, um, have played for a long time, and a lot of them have teach kids all the time. So they're very, very um, uh, established teachers and um, experienced teachers, and they're a lot of fun. I mean, we, we choose people as instructors that love kids and are great with kids. So you're going to have fun. I know Brazos Huval comes to mind. I know <laughs> Megan Constantin. I mean, the list goes on and on of uh, counselors that I've spent time with and I'm friends with at Acadia, and I know your kids will absolutely benefit being around. Um, but this camp, as we have 30 seconds left, uh, we're going to have a full list of how you can register, uh, where locations are happening, Opelousas and Lafayette, by the way. This camp, though, I think is a perfect opportunity as well. Um, it's still a camp. So maybe you sign your kid up and, man, you want them or they want to learn how to play something. It's not one of those, you know, hey, this isn't a band camp. This isn't a you're going to have to learn how to play something, and that's your only option. No, 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 no. Oh, no, we have a lot of fun. Music is a part of it, but it's a small part of it, right? We learn how to cook stuff. We do crafts. We do outside activities. We do scavenger hunts. We do fun little uh, science experiments. Um, we enjoy this beautiful uh, property. We go out in the canoes. Um, and the little boat rides. We have a lot of fun. And look, Acadiana, it's all happening this summer. It's back. I'm telling you, this camp, such a foundational part of what Louisiana Folk Roots is all about. More on our website, KLFY.com. She's Christine Balfa. Two sessions happening this June. I'm Gerald Grinnick, KLFY News 10. Hope you guys have a great Friday.